For today's Monday makeup lesson, I'm going to show you how to create an eye makeup look using no eyeshadows. So let's get started. For the first step, we are going to take a concealer that matches our skin tone or matches the foundation that you're wearing basically and apply this all over the lid to work as a base. I would recommend using something with decent coverage because we're using this as a base, we want to make sure it disguises any discoloration on the lid. So go for something with medium to full coverage. Once you've applied that with your fingertips or even your foundation brush, you can then go in with your blending brush that you typically use to apply eyeshadow and just buff and blend this in. And this will give you a similar finish to what you would expect from using an eyeshadow. Next, I want you to take a darker shade, so like a contouring shade of concealer, and I want to apply this in the crease of the eye, and then take your blending brush and sweep this over and back, just the same way that you would if you were using a darker shade in the crease area. Don't worry if it drops onto the lid, we can do a slight cut crease in a second. So just blend this over and back, making sure to get a soft effect that's deep in the crease and then fading up into nothing towards the brow bone. Now I want you to take a concealer that's a little lighter than your skin tone and you just want to apply this all over the lid in a sort of a cut crease kind of motion. This is basically going to create the illusion of a highlighter almost, but we're just using a lighter shade of concealer or you can use exactly the same shade that we were using earlier, but just go a little deeper with your contour. And you can use your blending brush or your fingertips to kind of tap this in, making sure to get that nice bright appearance in the inner corner. And you can also use the same concealer to highlight underneath the brow bone. So I typically just go underneath the arch of the brow and then I just blend it across, blending in with my fingertips. Now we want to set this in place. I'm going to be using a HT translucent powder and just patting this over the lid using my blending brush. This will give the illusion of that powdery finish that you would expect from an eyeshadow while also setting everything in place and keeping it on those lids. Now I'm going to apply some liquid liner. So this is going across the lash line and I actually have a full video talking about how to apply this in the most basic way. So if you want to check that out, I will link it at the top of the screen. And then I'm going to take another liner and this is a pencil black liner and we're going to tight line. So this is basically applying liner under the rim of the top part of the eye, if that makes sense. This will just create a deeper, darker effect. Once you leave that settle onto the eyes, you can then apply a lighter shade on the lower part or a darker shade, whatever works for you. I'm going to apply a skin matching pencil on the lower waterline to brighten up the eyes. And you can also apply this on that inner corner as well to add to the brightening effect. And then just apply lots of mascara, some falsies if you prefer, and this will really add to the drama of the look. And there you go, some subtle definition. You can use darker shades, lighter shades, whatever works for you. This is just a really subtle way to start applying some creams onto the lid rather than always using eyeshadow. Hope you guys enjoy this. Check out the other videos on the screen and I'll see you in the next one.